basically I start with an idea, so what I'm thinking about and what I want to make a piece about. A lot of potters are more um, focused on form, but for me I have a painting and drawing background, that's what I studied in college and did all my life. I started out taking pottery classes uh, well into adulthood after art school and I was just concentrating form and color and uh, when I could bring the two together, my, my past with, with imagery and drawing, uh, that was just wonderful for me. I feel very lucky to live in the age of Google <laughs> because uh, I can research everything I'm interested in. Sometimes it's an art historical example of um, it's a reference for the pot. Uh, Sometimes it's a stylization, and one of the things I'm really fascinated with is stylizations from one culture to the next. Um, how they might draw a tree or a cloud different. Like clouds are really fun, you know, whether, whether they're from Japanese art or Asian art or India. There's always a little different twist to the stylization. And often on times I'm referencing something historical, either in style or uh, the ceramic form, and it plays into the piece. Well, I, I love art history. When I was in college, I was an art major, and I took a lot of art history more than I needed to by choice. I can look at art books endlessly. I just, I just love it. Um, but with ceramics, it can also contribute to the piece, whatever the, the narrative is, or, or makes sense, like whether I choose a, a, a pitcher, or whether I choose a jar, or what. And I study art history and ceramic history a lot, and I, I know what's out there, and, and it'll just occur to me that that would be the form for this piece, once I have my idea. Well, I have what I want to share, and, but I, I feel like um, the viewer complete, completes the piece. I don't just make things. I, I don't have a strict interpretation. I think the viewer brings whatever is in them to the piece, and if it engages them, sometimes imagery particularly is a trigger for people. They'll buy something because it reminds them of something in their lives. It references something meaningful to them, so they're bringing themselves to it, which is great.